It's grooms take over as these four men put each other's weddings to the test. How will they shift gears to rate the gown? I really know nothing about wedding dresses. Ruching. No. Ruching sounds fancy. I have no idea what you're saying. Some kind of ruffle or feathers. I don't know. I have not a clue what ruching is. Flowery on the bottom or outgoing on the bottom. I have no idea what that means. Sweetheart neckline. What the hell's sweetheart neckline? A necklace? Sweetheart neckline maybe relates to high school and uh, something that's more conservative. Oh. I think that means when the neckline comes down to the cleavage area without showing too much boob. What? Empire waist has a cut. That would mean like the dress on the Empire State Building. I have no idea. Cap sleeves, I believe, resemble the dome of a baseball cap. A mermaid style dress, I do know what it is. What you call it? Oh my god. And it's fluff, fluffy in the bottom. Mermaid me as fashion, you mean? Or, okay. Mermaid means beautiful, elegant, kind of uh, slender. Uh, I'm trying to think of how to say this right. When the dress goes like pretty much all the way down, I think to about almost your ankles and then flares out at the bottom. I'm learning as we go here. Tool for the wedding. Tool is something bad or an annoying person. I guess you could use a tool to cut the cake. A knife, maybe? Maybe an ugly, inappropriate wedding dress? Is tool short for tulip? What is a tool? Why, did Ryan or Rick know what either one was? <laughs> That's a good question. It's a weird fabric, but it's everywhere in our wedding. <laughs> Not fair questions. <laughs> <laughs>